Hi guys, welcome back into my channel. So, today, I will be showing you how to become a good cuber. So, keep in mind, I'm still working on this myself. Um, but, this is what uh, I am trying to achieve. So, the first thing you have to do is learn the first ever Rubik's Cube which is the 3x3 three three. so you have to learn that and that can that can have the cross um, um, F2L which is slotting the first two layers here um, together at the same time then OLL, which is solving the yellow side, and PLL, which is um, <coughs> switching the top layer around without ch uh, without changing the solve yellow side and first two layers and the white side to uh, solve the cube. So that's it's called C help, and there's much more uh, solutions to solving it, like beginner's method and roots and just stuff like that so the, so after you've learned how to do the three by three you should next learn well not next learn but you should practice on the three by three so if before you're going like that you should first you should first try and learn new finger tricks which could look like this so if you're so if you say if you're doing the right algorithm um like this before um, you can learn new finger tricks like that. So then, and then you can learn, and then after you've learned new finger tricks, you have to learn how to improve your finger tricks in a faster way. So if you keep on practicing that, you can not just go like that, you can also go fast like that. So then after you've made finger tricks faster so you can do stuff like that my hands are pretty sweaty I've been cubing a lot so after you've learned how to be fast um, then you have to uh, hold on Okay, so after you've done that, then you next have to try and learn new puzzles. So maybe like pyraminx, uh, scube, 4x4, four four, which um, I'm not going to show you because it's that's what I'm using to hold up my camera. I shall show you. 4x4. And in general, other puzzles. I don't mean like tiny size, like I have a tiny 3x3. Three three. Uh, but yeah. So. Uh, I just messed up my hair. Um, yeah, but. So you're not just doing sizes of other puzzles you've tried, you're actually going to be trying other puzzles like these even ones that look crazy like this you have to give them a go to make and that would make you an actual proper cuba so 
um, after this, um, you should try, if there's any near you, you should try going to competitions where you can practice your things, your events, uh, and um, it will also challenge you and make you go faster, like, because say if you're not timing yourself, then you can just be going like that and taking time with your moves, but if you're timing it makes you more stressed and you want to turn faster. And that's how you would move faster on a cube. Because I, I got super fast because I was stressed about timing, so it makes me want, just want to speed up. So, uh, you're welcome. So, next. Um, let's say you're using a Rubik's brand. Pretend this was a Rubik's brand 3x3x3. Three by three by three. So, obviously you're not going to be... Uh, even that that fast on a Rubik's round. So what you would have to do is you would have to get cubes. So the first cube that I would recommend is the for nine dot. I'm in England. For nine pound, you would have the Moyu RS3M. 2020 so that cube is great you can customize it it is a stickerless rubik's cube which instead of looking like this and it has stickers on it looks more like this with no stickers on it so you should also try buy gan cubes um so like the gan 356m i think and the gan zen and 11m pro so uh uh yeah um buy good cubes like that those are the cubes i recommend for you um you should also not just get new ones three by three but so say if you had like really bad four by four like this is still really good for me and I can kind of do well on it but see look um, this, there's really good cubes out there but this isn't one of them like you have to promise I'm not editing this listen to this turning or even this for a fact And then listen to this. So, look, it's so hard to turn. So, I'm grateful that I even have a 4x4, four four, but there are way better ones. Way better 4x4s four out there. So, yeah. So you should get better cubes for other events. Uh, um, after you get really good cubes, then you just need to practice more and then you'll find yourself actually being fast. So you should time yourself. You should also get a stack map timer, but I don't have that. So... Uh, yeah, you just need to practice. I don't know why I'm like this. I'm just crazy. Uh, yeah, I'm just crazy in general. So, um, yeah. So, bye.